What's going on guys, EPO Action here, back with another video. Today I think it's episode 6 of my play review. And today's play review, sorry for the noise. Today's play review is Daniel Sturridge. Yes, that's right. England player, 26 years old, born in Birmingham, striker, and currently plays for Liverpool FC. So before I get into this video, I'll smash the like if you want more play reviews. And be sure to subscribe for more videos. So let's get into this. So Daniel Sturridge, we're going to review his player. Started his career at... Charlton, Villa, Coventry and Man City. That's the youth clubs he played at. But he started, did start at Manchester City. So as you can see, he trained with the first team. He had 16 appearances in a Premier League season. So he was looking pretty good. He was a pretty good talent. But um, as you can see, um, he yeah, he didn't really play a lot for Man City. Sorry for this. But I, I hate that. Um, obviously, he didn't play too many games for Man City. He only played 21 games on the Premier League. But obviously, he thought we thought Chelsea thought he could have lots of talent, so they decided to pick him up for how much money? Four-year deal. Yeah, okay, three point five million or something. Um, so yeah, obviously, and um, obviously that was in the Abramovich era, of course we know, and they spent a crap a load of money. And his first in Chelsea couldn't really get the goals, um, so he really struggled. He played twenty six games, only one goal. So he went to Bolton on loan. That's where he really went insane. This has been Boltman Premier League. Um, on loan for a short period of time. And I believe he scored like 8 goals in like... Let's check. Yeah, 8 goals in 12 games. That's a brilliant goal ratio. And obviously after that, he started to get really good uh, for Chelsea. He scored 11 goals in one season. Obviously got an England team. 13 goals overall of you. Um, yep. Uh, next year, um, but in the 2012-2013, which is the season that I started following soccer... Uh, EPL, and um, he only made seven appearances and he scored one goal, so that was pretty bad. And he was also on the sub bench a hell of a lot of time. So he, he thought, you know what, let's make a move and move to La La I don't know why I called him that. Liverpool, and they paid about 12 million to get him there. And people were like, he's going to be a Russian, you know, is he going to do well and all that stuff? Well, Liverpool fans, let's just say you really needed him because he got t 10 goals in 14 appearances, which was brilliant. A lot of people are like, oh yeah, when he plays his first full season, he might do well. 21 goals in 29 games. What? I remember him when he was insane. He was such a good player. And he obviously, that's in with SAS, you know, Sturridge and Suarez. They were amazing. But unfortunately, um, it hasn't been quite the same now. He's obviously got injuries last season on the opening day of the Premier League, I think it was. He got injured and scored four goals in 12 games, of course. Didn't play a lot, but he still got tons of it. He got a lot, probably was one of the probably goal scorers even though. Um, even though he missed like half the season, but not three quarters. But, um, see, so yeah, obviously, um, it really bugged him and he obviously got more injuries and all that stuff. But this season, he's only restricted his nine appearances. Good goal ratio, I guess, with five goals and scored today. And then, of course, four win, four one win against Stoke. But, like I said, you know. Hopefully he gets better soon. Um, I think he's going to stay at Liverpool. But, and yeah, so he's also representing his uh, national team. Um, he plays play for Great Britain in the Olympics. He's played 17 games for the England uh, national team. So um, yeah, so he's played 17 games, five goals. Those goals, I believe he did play the 2014 World Cup and he did score against Italy. Uh, so yeah, he scored against San Marino, who everyone scores against, Montenegro, Denmark, Peru and Italy in the World Cup. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty good. He's won, obviously, I think a Premier League title. Yeah, in 2009 10 season, he won the Premier League title. Uh, so, yeah, Daniel Sturridge, of course, being very unlucky with injury, but hopefully he can get better and start playing good next season. So, I'm gonna, despite, the, despite his injuries, I'm going to rate him 7.5, but I think he should get back to an 8 very soon if he continues his fantastic performance season. All right, guys, stay tuned for more play reviews and more videos. But besides that, see ya.